compound strength. One, and we're gonna start by just warming up here. We'll come down, make sure I'm squatting, and pick up the three pound weights. Okay, and we're gonna do a little squat um, for warming up. So we're not gonna come down very far. So I come down, I'm bringing my arms around. I'm come forward. Warming it up. Okay, so what we're gonna do next is just have your arms out right here. And I'm gonna squat side to side as my squat over to the left, my left um, arm will go out. Here we go. <clears throat> this is a warm up. A little tiny squat that's gonna work your triceps and your shoulders side to side bring it all the way out two more to each side now <clears throat> you have your right foot forward Left foot over here, and we're gonna squat down and then bring your arms forward and up. So I have it right here. Left foot forward, right one out. Try to bring them all the way up. Two more. Now we're gonna do that a little different. That was a little harder. <laughs> and you'll see why. Because we're going against gravity. So right foot forward, left foot over. I'm gonna come down, same thing, but lift up when I come up. Much easier. Sometimes I mess them up, mix them up, I should say. Get that squat. I hope you can tell the difference. <laughs> My arms are going up as I come up. And if it goes the opposite, you're going against gravity. So let's bring your arms down to the other side here. Make sure we do it right. You can work a little inner thigh here on the right. Get that squat. And actually when you do the, um, Compound moves, you don't need real heavy weights. A 
Hold them up. Your feet up high in the corner. Not too much, so we're not in a total plie. Arms are up. I'm gonna come down, bring them together. Here we go. You can get heavier weights. These are three pounds. When you get better at this, all you have to do to make it more challenging is up your weights. Almost. This is amazing for your arms too. Tap them together. I'm gonna do five more like this. Oops, four. Show you how you have to be engaged. Start looking out the window. Okay, two more. One more. Okay. Now that you have that, we'll do a little bit more with the three. So I'll have my toes all the way out. Get them to the corners of the room. And um, we're going to do those circles again. But I want to come down here. When I come up, I'm gonna come all the way around. Everybody get ready. Come down, hold it, up, stay down. I'm gonna stay down. Bring it up. Forward. Bring it up. Four more. You should feel that in your legs. One. Now come up. Hope you felt that one. Kind of kick it out a little bit. Okay. Do a little bit more of that plie stuff. And Play is wonderful for inner outer thigh. Let's get in that position. Now I came down and went forward. Now I'm gonna come with my palms facing each other. Okay, what I'm gonna do here, bring it together toward the back. You're not gonna Tap them in the back. Good for your posture. Pinch them down a little bit lower. Four more. One more. Slowly come up. Hope you felt that in your leg. Okay. Now, <clears throat> we're gonna do a, I'm still gonna use three, just for this first video, I think. Because it'll be challenging, and then we'll work our way up. So you have your left leg back, right leg forward. And, Palms are gonna be up, and I keep that front leg straight, I bend down the left. And we're gonna come down towards the floor and roll. <clears throat> you wanna do up five, you can do fives. I'm gonna work up to using 10 and 12 pounds. It's going to be a work your way up to your building your strength up through some compound moves. 
And what does compound moves mean? Well, using multiple muscles. Two more. I'm squatting back right here, here. Now you'll see it more when I switch. Right foot back, left foot forward, and I squat down right here on the right. Keep that left straight. We have two sides. So I'm gonna come down. Scooping something up. We'll do five more. Bring it in. One. Very good with that. <laughs> okay. Um have about nine minutes, nine or 10, I'm keeping them about 20 minutes because, you know, just to keep it simple. Okay, so what's gonna happen here, I'm gonna be on one leg, the left. I'm gonna do a little bit of balance also. So I'm gonna squat down a little bit on that left, but I'm gonna pick up my right, That'll work your core too. Squat down right here. Make sure you're squatting on that right. That little squat. bend a little bit when you're going to bring them back up. But I want this leg right here on the left to be straight. So then you go into that 90 degree right here. Show your muscles off. 
You don't have to come down as far as I do. You can come down until you feel that nice stretch. About five more. I like to mix it up to use your muscles just a little bit more. And that's very, very good. Very um, good thing to do. So I'm going to come down, put most of my weight on my left. And as I do that, I have the other foot forward. Then I'm gonna actually start up here. And I'm going to have my left arm come over across my body as I lift. Get that squat. I give that crunch. Crunching forward. Now the other side. So it'll be your right, forward, left kind of on the ball of your foot. And then I get that squat in there. That's gonna work your booty. As, and then you're gonna come up. Get that twist in there too. And crunch. Two or more. Ooh, you did good. One more thing. I'm gonna do squatting with it. I do love my squatting. And um, you can put your toes at different angles to um, work different muscles with how far apart they are. You're gonna be hip width apart. And we're gonna come up with the arms bent like this and then just like this, up and down. So we're gonna um, bring our arms up. We're gonna come down first. This is easier. All the way down yet. Now, we're going to reverse that a little bit. So, we're going to come down, all the way down. It's like you're pushing them back. I'm going to keep them up. You know, my shoulder's sometimes off on my right. There. 
I think that's a good, a good start of what we're gonna do. Um, we're gonna be doing some circles, that kind of stuff. And we're gonna do one right here. One more thing. I always say that, but I always do more. So I'm gonna get that little squat going here, just a little bit. Down a little bit further, down a little bit further, down a little bit further, right here, and do circles. Towards each other. Other way. Get down low. Put your hands right here. Slowly come up. Actually, I should have dropped them first. Woo. Now, do a little stretch. Left foot forward. Right one here. I'm just going to sit back into that hip and run my hand down the leg. And you can bring the other hand. If you can't, if you can't come down that far, you do the outside of your calf. But I come down to the shoe and I pull. We do a little bit of stretching. Now hands back. And then come up, pinch, and do the other side. So you're just gonna come down. And you can bring that opposite hand over to the outside of the leg or by the foot and bring your body down. Get a nice stretch. Now I'm just going to have my hands back. I tuck here on the right. I come up. We're going to do a few shoulder rolls back. Pinch, there, chest out, shoulder blades together. And that's gonna be it for our first um, compound strength. 